As the holy month of Ramadan comes to an end, Muslims all around the world prepare themselves for Eid al-Fitr, the festival of breaking the fast. It is a time of joy and celebration where families and friends come together to share their blessings and express their gratitude for the blessings of Allah. Here are eight things Muslims should do on the day of Eid al-Fitr. 1. Attend Eid prayers One of the most important things that Muslims should do on Eid al-Fitr is to attend the Eid prayers. These prayers are held in the morning, usually in an open space or a mosque, and are led by an imam. The prayers consist of two rak'ats and are followed by a sermon in which the main delivers a message of hope, love, and gratitude. It is important to attend these prayers as they are a way of showing our gratitude to Allah for the blessings of Ramadan and for guiding us through this holy month. Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him would gather with his companions and offer prayers in the congregation. He would offer two rak'ahs of Eid prayer, which is a special prayer offered only on the occasion of Eid. After the prayers, Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him would deliver a sermon to his followers. In his sermon, he would remind them of the importance of fasting during the month of Ramadan and the significance of Eid al-Fitr. He would also encourage them to give charity to the poor and needy, which is considered a virtuous act in Islam. 2. Give charity Charity is an integral part of Islam, and it is particularly important during Eid al-Fitr. Muslims are encouraged to give generously to those in need, whether it is in the form of money or food. This is a way of sharing our blessings with others and spreading joy and happiness during this special occasion. Giving charity is also considered a way of purifying our souls and seeking forgiveness from Allah. 3. Visit family and friends Eid al-Fitr is a time of celebration and joy, and one of the best ways to celebrate is by visiting family and friends. It is a time to strengthen bonds and show love and appreciation for those around us. Visiting family members who live far away is also a great way to reconnect and catch up on each other's lives. Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him would then celebrate Eid al-Fitr by spending time with his family and friends and would also distribute gifts and sweets among the children and the less fortunate. 4. Prepare special Eid meals. During Eid al-Fitr, it is customary for Muslims to prepare special meals to share with family and friends. This is a time to indulge in delicious food and enjoy each other's company. Preparing special meals is also a way of showing love and hospitality to guests and sharing our blessings with others. 5. Wear new clothes. Wearing new clothes on Eid al-Fitr is a tradition that is followed by Muslims all around the world. It is a way of showing respect for the occasion and celebrating the end of Ramadan. It is also a way of expressing joy and happiness and feeling good about ourselves. 6. Spending time in reflection and gratitude. Eid al-Fitr is a time to reflect and express gratitude for the blessings of Allah. It is important to take some time out of the festivities to reflect on our spiritual journey and the lessons we have learned during Ramadan. We should also express gratitude for the blessings that Allah has bestowed upon us and make a conscious effort to appreciate the little things in life. It is important to note that the Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him did not celebrate Eid al-Fitr in a lavish or extravagant manner. Instead, he emphasized the importance of simplicity and humility, reminding his followers that true happiness comes from being grateful for what he have and sharing it with others. He would also visit the sick and the elderly, showing them love and compassion on this special day. 7. Spread love and kindness. Eid al-Fitr is a time to spread love and kindness to those around us. It is a time to forgive and forget and to let go of any grudges or negative feelings we may have towards others. 
We should make an effort to be kind to everyone we meet and to spread joy and happiness wherever we go. 8. Read Quran Reading Quran is an important aspect of Islam and it is particularly important during Eid al-Fitr. We should always take some time out of the festivities to read the Quran and reflect on its teachings. It is a way of connecting with Allah and seeking guidance and inspiration. Eid al-Fitr is a special occasion for Muslims around the world. It is a time to celebrate the end of Ramadan and express gratitude for the blessings of Allah. Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him played an important role in its celebration during his lifetime. He would offer prayers, deliver sermons, distribute gifts, and spend time with his family and friends. His actions serve as an example for Muslims around the world to follow, emphasizing the importance of gratitude, compassion, and generosity on this special day. Eid Mubarak to all our followers, and may Allah grant all of your wishes this Eid. Have you ever wished that there was a Muslim version of YouTube or Netflix? Well, we have created one. The One Islam TV app has no adverts and is safe to browse for your peace of mind. Watch hundreds of high quality produced Islamic reminders, Quran videos, stories of the prophets, hot topic, debates, and so much more. Four to eight new videos are uploaded daily, inshallah. You can watch or listen to videos while your device is switched off. Watch videos on demand or download videos and watch offline. One Islam TV is 100% run and owned by Muslims, which means the small amount you pay for your subscription is a sadaqah jariya, continuous charity for you, as we use the funds raised to continue producing more beneficial videos and reminders, inshallah. The One Islam TV app is now available on Apple devices, Apple TV, Android devices. Android TV, Amazon Fire TV, and Roku. So you can watch on most devices and smart TVs. Download now for a free 7-day trial. May Allah reward you for supporting our work.